Josephine. Josephine, Josephine, President Biden. Oh. Talk. Hi, I'm Josephine. How are you, Josephine? Thank you. Yeah. Wow. Three younger sisters. Yeah, Beatrice, Francis, and Kitchen. Yes. Well, this is Biden. My wife is the oldest of five daughters. Oh, wow. And you're the oldest of four daughters. Yeah. <laughs> That's a lot you of know, girls. You know what's great about being a man who marries into a family with four or more daughters? What is, what's great about that? What's good about that is one of them always loves you. Even when your wife's married, <laughs> they always stick with you. You always have an ally somewhere along the line. <laughs> That's funny. <laughs> well, you are lovely. I wish I could get to meet you guys. Maybe one day I will. Oh. You must be so proud of your dad. Wow, oh, this is really cool. Oh, <laughs> I see you on the TV a lot, and I'm like, wow, I'm actually talking to you. I wish you the best of luck in your presidency, and I hope everything goes smoothly. Well, God love you. You are smart as a devil, too, aren't you? You want me to go? like Yes, we have Springfield, yeah. Illinois. Yes. Yeah. yeah. And doctor, what, what, what city or town in Nigeria are you from? I've been to Nigeria. Yes, uh, we are from um, uh, Ibadan. That is Oyo State. Yes. Yeah. Very, well, I'll be done. Yes, very close to Lagos yeah. State. Yes. Well, so. You know, Josephine, you know why America is so strong? Why is that? Because, for real. Because we're a nation of immigrants. We're all from all over the world. That's, yeah. like your, that's like your daddy's family had the courage to pick up and leave everything they knew and come to America. My great-grandpops, they, they got in a, what they called a coffin ship in the Irish Sea to come to the United States of America way back in the 1800s when, wow. when Catholics wow. weren't allowed very much in the United States. And so we're, 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 we're a people who, we, we were held together, not by where we're from, but what we believe. Yes. What we believe. Yes. And it makes us really so strong. That's, yes. That's why we're strong. Yeah, I know, like, like in history class, my teacher calls America the melting pot of, like, cultures and everything because there's so many people from different places bringing their culture to America. That's why it's so amazing. God love you. You are really smart. Thank you. <laughs> now you got to remember me when you're president of the United States. Oh. <laughs> when, 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 you, when you come to the White House, when I come to the White House, when you're president, they say, Joe Biden is outside. <laughs> we don't say, Joe who? Okay. <laughs> okay. Oh. Okay. What? Well, House when this oh. when, 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 when the virus calms down. Oh my goodness, that will be oh, historical because that will be you know that's my dream. We've never been there, even we've never been to D, you know DC, but we follow everything. You know, I've been looking at most of your videos when you were young. You know, as a young senator then in the seventies, <laughs> how you stood up. You know, uh, for black people, and I said, wow. I mean, this is well, not beginning right now. It has been, you know, in your uh, gene. It is running in your veins. So we really appreciate that. And uh, I know you're a man of your work. And that is more reason why we follow you all around, anywhere, whatever we do. And uh, I pray that God will give you the wisdom, the direction, you know, to do the right thing, you know, for American people and for the entire world. Because your position is a delicate position. And uh, that makes you to be the father of the whole world. And uh, you are carrying a heavy load, but God will help you to carry it. Well, I have, I have people like you praying for me, and I have people like you in this country who care so much about the country. Yes. And the reason I ran was because I thought we had to restore the soul of this country, yes. the kind of people we were. And that's why if you take a look at my administration, yes. 
we have more African Americans in positions of authority in the cabinet and other throughout. Wow. Yes. Than well, I mean, yeah. That's how I got involved in politics in the first place. Yes. My state was a state that was segregated by law. Mm. And uh, that's how I got involved, the segregating the state, and that's how I got involved in getting engaged in public life. That's why I ran. Wow. And, uh, and by the way, the only reason I'm a United States senator is because the African-American community, as my whole career, all the way back when I was a 29-year-old kid running for the Senate, wow. before I was old enough to be sworn in, you have to be, Josephine, you have to be 30, 30. years old to yeah. be sworn in, but you're going to get elected before then yeah. if you wait till you get to be 30. Oh. And the reason I got elected was mm. because my state, as the eighth largest black population in America. So wow. The Senate population. Wow. Wow. And, and what happened was 96% of my state and the black community voted for me. Wow. Wow. And, wow. And so that's where, I, that's, where I, that, that's where my heart is. And wow. Uh, wow. And, we, and we're going to make real progress, Josephine. <laughs> that's why I picked the first black woman ever to oh. be a vice president of the United States of America. Well, wow. Thank you. Wow. I was really happy when I saw that because, you know, it's a little bit of representation, you know, like seeing somebody who looks like me and like such a position of power. It's really it's really it makes me feel good. You know, on a lot of other black girls like me, seeing somebody who looks exactly like them on TV, on like in a place of power makes them feel really happy, you know. Well, you are really something else. I can hardly wait to meet you. And by the way, I have four granddaughters. Wow. And, and they're crazy about me. <laughs> I'm crazy about them. You know what I used to say, Josephine? What did they say? When time they're, when, when they're, time they're little babies, I, they, their mommy and daddy would let me rock them to sleep. And I'd say loud enough for everybody in the family to hear, and I'd put them in the crib. I'd say, remember... Your favorite person in the whole world is your pop. <laughs> your favorite person. In the oh, world. thank you, brother. Say it again. Now, now, when the girls come up in front of everybody, I say, girls, tell everybody who your favorite person in the whole world is. They'll say, pop. Yes. <laughs> so, so I'm crazy about them. They're all going to be, and you'll see them on inauguration day when you look on television yes. because I'm going to make sure they're standing right next to me when I get sworn in yes. as President of the United States. Good. Yes. yes, yes. I'll be watching. <laughs> yes. Well, good. You, good. I can hardly wait to meet you, honey. <laughs> I really can. That would be I'm nice. I'm going to be my girl. Aww. Can you say so hi? Can I you say hi? Girl. Hi. Hello. President Biden. Hi, Joe. President Joe Biden. How are you, baby? Who is this one now? Beatrice. Beatrice, how are you, baby? I'm doing fine. Like... How are you? I'm well. You're eight years old, Beatrice? Yes, I am. I tell you what, Doc, you're a lucky man. <laughs> lucky, lucky man. And now, you girls take care of your daddy, right? Yes. yes. We daddies need help. You know what I mean? <laughs> Yeah. So you gotta you, you gotta help raise us. You know it's hard raising the daddy. <laughs> okay. Okay. All right. Well, Doc, it's a pleasure to talk to you. And even I must tell you, a greater pleasure to talk to your daughters. And uh, there's nothing like a daughter. My daughter. <laughs> I have two daughters. I lost one in an automobile accident, but my daughter is a grown woman. And a social worker, yes. and uh, and she is uh, she is the love of my life and the life wow. of my love. Aww. Wow! And she, and she's a social worker. She went to uh, undergraduate school and then she got her master's degree in social work. And she works with troubled kids, and boys and girls clubs, and, and wow. to helping out. She's a great kid. Wow! And so Aww. one of these days, I hope we can actually get you guys for real. Yes. Right here, I'm going to make sure. We figure out a way when you're able to travel to get you guys to the White House. Oh, oh that would be nice. Thank you. Thank you. Here, that here, would be here, nice. Here comes the person who brought Mush. Where is she? I don't know where she's going now. <laughs> uh, I, thought, I, I thought it was my wife. <laughs> oh, okay. <laughs> oh, Dr. Jim, oh, yes. I want you to say hello. Wow. Oh, my goodness. Bye, Dr. Bye. She's a 
teacher. Oh. Professor. Yes. Oh my God. Uh, wow. And uh, Jill, I'm, 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 I'm talking to Dr. OK, but I want you to know he has four daughters. I was telling him that you're one of five daughters. <laughs> the oldest. And Josephine, say hello to Dr. Biden, Mrs. Biden. Hello. Dr. Biden. Hi, how are you? Good. Good. Oh my goodness. <laughs> really smart Hi, I'm Josephine. <laughs> Hi. How are you? Good. How are you? I'm doing well. Where do you guys live? We live in Springfield, Illinois. I'm supposed to Springfield, Illinois. Oh. Congratulations. Congratulations on everything. I can't wait till you become the first lady. <laughs> Oh, thank you. Please make it, President Biden, please make it real. We would love to call, please. No, I'm serious. I'm serious. We don't say anything we don't mean. Wow. We don't say anything we don't mean. Wow. By the way, you know how your daddy, of all the people who could treat you, you're the one who picked basically out of a hat somebody who is going to being the one we call and recognize. Oh. And that's why we called you today. Thank you. You Thank made a five dollar contribution and a seven dollar contribution at a time when uh actually donated twice to the inaugural committee. Yes. And so I wanna thank you and hopefully uh when things get squared away you can come and see us, okay? Yes. That would be nice. <laughs> that would be nice. Thank you so much. Girl, and girl, go girl, continue to see <laughs> Hard raising the daddy, but be patient with him, okay? Okay, <laughs> we will, we will. All right, bye-bye, guys. Bye-bye, President. Thank you so much. Bye. God bless you. Dr. Biden, thank you so much. God bless you. God bless your family. Thank you. Amen. Bye-bye. Bye. -bye. bye. bye.